Welcome back, Captains. We're down here at the Dunlop and Boat Ramp, and guess what? This beauty comes in right here. Everybody's sitting down real nice for the captain there, not jumping over to one side, and everything's pretty much perfect. Currently, we've got a headwind to the camera here, so he's got kind of a crosswind, and all he'd have to do is shut the motor off, and he'd probably just float right into the dock. Well, red shirt hops up, gets over there, and does a little straddle thing over in the front. I think he's getting ready, but he's only halfway there. I was on my YouTube live when I was doing this, so you might hear me narrate something in the background. The red shirt guy's catching some Z's. He's going to relax there for just a minute until this thing gets over here to the dock where he can actually jump off and do something. Now the one on the left looks like she don't want to be here no more. And the guy standing there at the dock, he's not making eye contact with him because he don't want to be involved. The girl in the front said this was supposed to be a four hour boat rental, but at least everybody's in good spirits. Now the boat captain in the back, he left the Bahamas earlier when they started this and they're just now getting in. The pelicans have mated, they had babies. The little brown birds have mated, they'd have babies. And they're all grown up. And the two ladies walking across here travel back to 1992 and got one of them swimsuit t-shirts. Wait a second, he didn't tie it off? I don't understand why this is so hard here, but I'm officially naming this boat Little Blue Pill. Welcome to Credit Card Captain.
from the looks of it, that front end is tied on so tight, that boat ain't going anywhere even if you cut the line. He finally wakes up and uses the motor to swing it back around. Nice job. Well, I think that's pretty much it for that one right there. I told you this one's going to be painful. Now, y'all need to sit back, sit down, relax, and get some popcorn. And the next time someone tells me, instead of filming, why don't you get down there and help them? What do you want me to do? I'll probably end up just saying, come over to the dock. I don't teach driver's eds for boats. I don't know what to tell you. Yeah, you thought this was going to be over. Throws him a line and just like that, he throws it back. Captain Whiskey throttles it real quick, boom, right in the back of the dock, and then bottom boom. The other boat captain doesn't even realize anything happened. Now let me remind you, those two guys over there had lines in their hand, and all they had to do was pull the thing over the ramp. That Rowdy right there could have probably figured it out. And I heard he can drive a boat too. This is him last week when someone said, you ain't gonna do nothing, you ain't got nothing, you can't bite me, you're on a leash. Now if I didn't tell you, that other pontoon boat's still over there on the left hand side. These are back to back. The key to the boat ramp is don't come down here and block the ramp. And that's what this guy with the red top boat is doing. At this ramp here on the right hand side, there's like three different slips that you can come into. Go grab your trailer, put it in the water and come in. It doesn't screw up the line either. These things have three throttle positions. Go, no, and uh-oh. And everybody's over there giving them tips, but it ain't helping. Well, king of the credit card captains is this right here. Actually, when my wife leaves town and takes the truck, this is what I end up doing right here.
on there. Maybe. I hate to say this, but they were in this same position about five and a half minutes ago, and that boat might have some damage on it. We'll check it out when it comes out. If you ain't ever been to Florida and walked on the boat ramps here, you get this stuff called Jiffy Feet. If you don't know what Jiffy Feet is, walk around here and they'll be black as tar. Normally you can see this at the Jiffy stores and those people that walk in with no shoes on. Well, you wanted some more painful, we're going to bring this bad boy in right here. No, I'm just kidding. They did a good job. All right, let's watch how Booty Shaking does it right here. Booty Shaking is the name of the boat. They got a cute pup on the boat, and they're going to be featured. Whoa, what is that? Is that one of them anti-slip walkers that you come down here on the boat ramp with? I think it is. This captain knows. This ride over here is slipperier than... Now, he'll set that down there and make sure that he can hold on to all 180 degrees of it. He coils up his line right there. Yeah, that's it. Now, if you didn't know where the fist bump originated from, this is it right here. It's so that you don't interlock fingers and make eye contact and fall in love at the boat ramp. The fist bump keeps a little bit of distance. Now you know. Well, a lot of you have been telling me that you want the videos longer. I gave you this one a little bit longer here, and my wife tells me the same thing, but she don't even watch my videos. The kids and her came down the other day and brought me some lunch. It was pretty nice. Now surprisingly the red top guy, he backs down here nice and easy and gets that in. I'm surprised to see it in this based on the behaviors I observed. Well, I think that's it. Just like this pup here, it's time to go. I'll see you guys again soon. Thanks for watching, liking, and subscribing.